Hey everybody, Dave Williamson at my desk, and today's video is a P917 collection. Well, there's going to be some Johnny Lightnings, but no, this one is a P917 collection that just came in from one of my customers. He wanted to trade in his P917 collection for a couple of other cars. So let's open this box and see what's inside. <laughs> All right, here we are in the photo studio opening the box. Here it comes. Oh, hey, there's one in a blister pack. Whoa, there they go. Nicely packaged. Look at that. This is really nicely packaged in there. We got some padding. We got some peanuts. Everything in a little bubble with a little napkin over the top. Should be some nice ones in here. Let's see. What do we got here? What do we have? This one. Oh, look at that. It's got a little bulge in its base. That's weird. Got a little bump in its face. This one, yellow Hong Kong. Yellow Hong Kong, pretty darn nice for yellow Hong Kong. Let's get up a close look at that. Very, very nice. Yes. All right, put that aside for a moment here. Maybe take this stuff out. Let's see what we've got here. Pull this to the side and unwrap. Hey, we got Rose, Rose, this one Light on the back, dark on the front in rows. This one not in great shape, but it's okay. Got a lot of chips on the front, dark in the front. Let's check out the wheels here. Looks like we've got good, good action here. Try the back. Decent, dull inside, dull on bottom. Not great, not great, but okay. Let's take a look here. Opening up, we've got a bubble box here with two cars inside. Oops, peanuts everywhere. Peanuts everywhere. All right. When I get all done, I will... Uh, oh, man. Sometimes the tape is uh, strong. Wow. Get these out. Unwrap nice soft tissue. Green. Oh, green Hong Kong. Green. This one's got something going on. Looks like the window's been glued in. Window potentially has been glued in, and that glue affected this window up here. A lot of chips on front. Does have a set of reproduction decals on it, or stickers. And there it is. Look at that. Huh. Glued that window in. Got some scratches and things. Looks like the, you know, you don't want to use uh, super glue on any kind of a plastic because it'll haze up the plastic. It looks okay. Uh, let's see, what's this one? Alright. Man, I gotta get the scissors or something. This is hard. Let's see, 1970 light green. Alright, let's take a look here. Light green is always a great color. Look at that. It's got the original stickers on it. Light green. Get in there close. Get in there close on the light green. Looks like the uh, original what was in the blister pack the color bled through and discolored the the stickers on this one all right light green nice plastic boxes they can always use these things come from the red line club let's see do i have any scissors <clears throat> get a knife this tape really holds on good you ever try to rip a piece of Cellophane tape, it is not easy to do. All right, here we are. Magenta, look at that berry. A magenta color, very nice. This one's pretty. Base has got a little dullness to it there, but it looks real good on top, matching front and back. Good clear windows, only a few minor dings. Of course, on the sharp areas, you're always gonna have a little bit of rubbing on the front and the back on the sharp areas, you know, chip on, on the ends. But good, very good color, nice looking Porsche 917. All of these are Porsche 917s, of course. This one says BP Pool, which it probably is. Let's see. Oh, I see one of the, it's not a blister pack in the box. It's a blister pack in the box. A blister pack with no car in it because one car has been taken out of the blister. And it was probably this one. Ooh, wow. I think, you know, when I, I think I sold this to the guy. And uh, when I sold it, I thought, wow, that sure is pretty. I'd like to take that out of the blister pack myself. Look at that Hong Kong blue Porsche 917. 
Very, very nice. And one more, I think. Nope, two more. Two more. This one is yellow. Yellow Porsche 917. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that one's nice. Porsche 917 yellow. How are we looking? Are we looking good? Looking good? I think I have, you know, when you're doing a... My camera will focus close and then away really fast. That's why I use this camera because it's the fastest at doing that. A lot of cameras cannot do that. But this one can. But then if you get something in the background, it'll tend to look for it. And that messes it up. Oh, we got another rose. This one matches almost exactly front and back. A little bit different. And has a little bit, quite a bit of wear on it. This one's got quite a bit of wear. As you can see, the wear points on the back there. And on the front there. That focused in. All right. I think we're going to put these on a turntable and give a another look at all of them let's see i'm gonna clean this up and i'll be right back all right here's the magenta the magenta looks real nice and a near mint got really nice uh, looks to be original stickers on it wheels are nice the glass is very clear just the very minor uh, rubs on the sharp points of the car of course the porsche 917 does have a lot of sharp points on it so you're going to get a little uh, rubbing here and there but the color is good magenta is nice and dark so it covers up any possibility of of small spots and uh, the front and back look to be very closely matching in color There are two rows in this lot. This one in good to excellent condition, not quite excellent uh, because the wheels are a little dull, missing a little chrome. The color is good, a little bit of hazing throughout, uh, some wear on all the high points, and uh, good clear windows on there. Got a couple of the original stickers on it. Uh, Nick's on the upper fenders there. Overall, not too bad. A good, a good beginner car for the Porsche 917 in the rose color. All right, here's another rose. This one non-matching front and back. The back is a nice, uh, even color of rose. The front is toned to a much darker shade. Wear on all the high points. Uh, wear on the wheels and dull on the base. Uh, probably good to excellent on that. Not quite excellent, but uh, definitely better than a good car as far as the conditions go that I use. Does look halfway decent. Nice and dark on the front if you're displaying the front and you want a different shade. And there you go. Get a nice dark rose. The interior on this one looks more tan than some of them. They, they tend to look anywhere from white to tan, and this one definitely looks more like a tan interior all right this one yellow us or possibly lime you know actually i think in the, now that i think about it is a lime us not quite yellow enough to be yellow like this one so lime us light toning on front on the door there you can see the toning and uh, just a minor minor wear on the car good looking car overall yellow is a very difficult car to get or lime, as I should say, lime. It's a very difficult color to get. The brighter colors on the Porsches are difficult because they all tend to be toned and darkened. The darker colors, like the dark blue, the magenta, are a little easier to get uh, pretty cars. This one looks pretty good. Got nice wheels on it. Probably near mint on this one. And uh, a nice color for the Porsche 917 rainbow which is very very popular with people to get a rainbow of Porsche 917s oops all right here is a blue Hong Kong this one was the blister pack pole and it is in mint condition or mint minus I usually use because even a brand new car out of the blister will have some sort of imperfection and with the Porsche uh, there's always going to be uh, light nicks here and there. Now, I don't know exactly if all the cars were done this way, but um, a lot of the cars uh, that were made in Hong Kong actually came to the States 
loose and then were put into packages here. I'm not sure what the exact details on that are, but they definitely, and that is why they have chips on them because they didn't go directly into the blister packs. They were made in Hong Kong and packaged in the USA. And if you have any information about any details about that process, please leave them in the description below or give me a call and let me know, text message, email, uh, you know how to reach me. Here's the green Hong Kong. Green Hong Kong in good condition. It's got a new set of stickers on it. Uh, There's a lot of wear on this particular one. It's got chips on front, wear on the corners and edges, and uh, the back window has been glued in and has some fogging from using super glue, which you should never use on a Hot Wheels car. No super glue, please. And there is the green Hong Kong. Good color for the car. Of course, every Porsche is nice every color. I love them all. All right, this one is really pretty. The yellow Hong Kong. Tough color. Very, very nice. It's got a couple of small areas of paint imperfection on the lower driver's door, but it's very minor. Overall, the car looks like a blister pack pull not has not been shot through uh, superchargers for sh probably and you can see right there on the two spots on there it's very very minor very beautiful car for Hong Kong yellow goes good with the blue hey let's put the blue on there very nice look at that very nice let's put the green Hong Kong in there and see how they all look rotating together oh look at that yeah slide that back slightly Look at that, rotating together. Look at those colors, that's fantastic. Wow, I think I could just look at that all day. That is so pretty. Let's throw in another one. How about magenta? Throw that magenta in there. Ooh, look at that, wow. Let's back her up, back her up, slide her back. Let's put the light green in there too. Look at that, hey, all right. That is gorgeous. Let's see if we can get a couple more in there before we Bring this video to a close. The rose and US yellow. Hey, get her all in there. All right. What do you think? Pretty nice, huh? Let's pan up. There it is. Thanks for joining me for this Porsche 917 experience. Beautiful. Get out there and collect yourself up some Porsches. These things are nice. Very popular, too. Check it out. Thanks for watching. Be sure to stop by, by I'm gonna blah, 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 stop by my website toycarcollector.com and don't forget the car in toycarcollector.com. Thanks now. Bye.